So now we come to Italy, central Italy, in fact, uh, and Tuscany. And uh, this little interior is, is a painting of a cafe in uh, Monte Regioni. It's one of my favourite little places. It really hasn't changed probably in the last 80 plus years. It still has this wonderful Art Deco interior and looks out through the back windows over the most amazing Tuscan Valley. And it's a wonderful place just to sit and drink coffee and listen to the music. One of the challenges about painting these interiors is dealing not only with uh, the natural light, but also, of course, with artificial light. It throws up a whole new set of challenges and a whole new set of opportunities to play with colour and light and reflections. And uh, it's the sort of painting I really enjoy working on. Well, here we are now in um, Pienza. And uh, one of those little exterior cafe scenes that I just, I, I just enjoy so much painting. And in fact enjoy so much being part of. These are these little outdoor cafes with these wonderful parasols where you can, you can just sit and drink coffee, have a glass of wine, sit and sketch. You get left alone for two, three hours. It's not a bad way to spend an afternoon. If at the end of the day you, you can produce a, a lovely little painting like this, then uh, there's nothing wrong with it really, is there? In this painting we're in the foothills below Montalcino. Montalcino, of course, famous for its wine, um, very friendly people, and these wonderful landscapes, these undulating valleys that, that sit nestled below these hilltop towns. And One of the things I like about this painting is, yes, it's a vineyard painting, but it's a vineyard painting with a slight difference. It hasn't got those hot orange Tuscan colours that perhaps you might expect. What I've tried to show here is uh, these deep shadowed valleys where these mists roll in and just sit. They give it a huge depth to a landscape. We go from this crisp, clear foreground where you can actually wander down through these vines and over these undulating hills and off into the distance. You can do it on foot if you like, or you can sit in front of this painting and just do it by eye.